Are your grain storage bins empty? If not, when is the last time that you checked them? Grain storage is the topic for today's Iron Talk. Grain storage issues vary depending on the climate where you happen to farm, but there are two things that remain constant. You must control the moisture content of the grain, and you also need to control the temperature of the grain. Here are the guidelines. If you're going to store soybeans for any amount of time, 13% is the wettest you'd like those beans. For corn, it's 15%. Even so, if you'd like to store them for a longer time, you'll need that moisture percentage even lower than that. What happens as humidity levels rise in the spring and summer is that the equilibrium moisture content between grain and outside air no longer exists. When humidity levels are around 70% and soybean moisture is at 13%, you generally won't see problems. As humidity exceeds 70% and runs up to 90% or more, the soybeans simply can't absorb the extra humidity, leading to the surface of the beans becoming wet and ultimately spoiling. The temperature of the grain in storage is also important. In winter months, grain is often cooled to 40 degrees Fahrenheit and generally remains just above freezing. In the spring and summer months, when outside air is 15 degrees or more above the temperature of the grain, condensation can accumulate on the grain, leading to spoilage. The key takeaway today is to keep grain dry and within 15 degrees of outside air temperatures as long as you can to lengthen the time that you're safely able to store it. That's all for today's Iron Talk, and now back to the show.